Hi everyone, I hope you're all doing well. Sorry about the messy hair. <laughs> I have just come back home from having spent the morning at the health center. Uh, everything is absolutely fine. Routine uh, tests for pregnant women. I don't know if you can see that. I've had some some blood taken. I've done this like mandatory glucose test that they do for all pregnant women over the age of 25 apparently. It takes two hours and they have to prick you three times um, and test your blood and see how like your sugar levels rise after you've had this really really sweet drink basically when you first arrive. Quite an interesting morning but I spent most of the time just watching Handmaid's Tale so it wasn't too bad but I have had to fast before that so now Dave's just made us breakfast so we're gonna go and eat that and then start the rest of the day. So I am showered, dressed, hair washed, dried, made up everything and ready to go because true to uh, cat vlogging tradition we're of course on the run today because why would I vlog if we were just in the house that would be so boring but anyway so uh, not only did I have the glucose test today but we also have a an appointment with our nurse which happens about once a month so this is like pregnancy related uh, both the test and the appointment with the nurse and uh, we have to leave, I think, here in about four minutes. So we're a little bit on a schedule. And <laughs> Couldn't find my socks. <laughs> Maybe it's because you leave them everywhere where they're not supposed to be. Mm -hmm. Just as a, an now idea. Now's not the time, Cadwallader. Okay, sorry. No, now is <laughs> not the time. Let's go see what the nurse has to say. I'm today eager to talk to her about my weight gain because I haven't gained so much weight. Actually, I was going to take a picture of my little notes. Um, so I'm eager to see what she has to say about that. And then we're going to go for lunch and some other stuff. So yeah, hang along. Hang along? Why do I keep saying that? <laughs> what does it mean? <laughs> gone too far because I now have my own lure box and my own lures and your own rod and a new rod and new. I've been using my grandpa's old uh, rod but now I have my very own one but I'm still gonna use his real real this is my grandfather who's no longer with us so I'll have a piece of him with me mm -hmm. when we go fishing and then they've got me my very own tackle box Ooh. I've heard you say that word, but I don't really know what it means, but I'm assuming it's something to do with lures, a lure box. Yeah. Here are my lures. Have you named them yet? No, but I'll tell you what they're... Well... It, not One's disco fever. Only disco fever. That's disco fever in there because it's glittery. You can't really see it here. Anyway, so secretly pretty excited about that. Yeah, <laughs> who'd have thought a few years ago? that I would have my own lure box or tackle box mm -hmm. and my own rod and everything. It's pretty fun. So I am finally back home. Dave's been home for a few hours already, but after we had lunch at a restaurant in Helsinki, after the whole, um, I don't know what to call it in English, nurse appointment, basically, neuvola, we call it in Finnish, rod evening in Swedish. Then I also went and saw my friend's new flat in Helsinki, which was amazing. Um, so I've only made it home now and it's quarter to seven. But the nurse appointment was really good. It was very informative. We had a new nurse. Oh, I think I told you guys about how we got dumped by our nurse because <laughs> she got a better job, basically. So we've we've now got a new nurse, but her English was flawless and she was really really nice so it was all a very positive experience. I asked her about my weight now when I weighed myself there on the scale uh, before the appointment because you have to do like before each nurse appointment you do a, uh, a urine sample test thing basically to check the 
I want to say like protein in your pee or something. Um, don't don't quote me on that. And you also have to take your own blood pressure and you have to weigh yourself. So now when I weighed myself, it showed that I had gained like, I think four and a half kilos or something like that, which is still quite little, but she said that some women just gain more in the third trimester. So I mustn't worry about it. Keep eating healthy and I just have to assume that some more weight will come at some point. But it's a weird thing, like when you, you've spent most of your adult life trying to not gain weight and now you actually want to gain weight. So it's, it's confusing <laughs> and it's weird. What she also looked at during the appointment was my hemoglobin because it had been a bit low last time. So they recommended that I start taking some iron tablets. I've been taking them now for a month, but now when she took my hemoglobin today, it had actually gone down, further down. So that was a little bit weird, um, but she said, you know, it's fine. And then like 20 minutes later, after we've left, I got a text message from this nurse saying that actually, um, if you could go and take another blood sample because they just wanna like find out what's going on with the um, hemoglobin levels. Hopefully they can figure out what's up or if I have to worry or not worry. I probably don't have to worry. I don't feel, I don't feel like anything's really wrong with me. So fingers crossed regarding that. Anyway, now I'm, I've gotten to be chatty Cathy. So I will leave you with that. Thank you guys so much for watching this video. I hope that you have an amazing day and I will see you again very soon. Bye.